Hey guys, Paco Aras Pauchaga here. I got with me the Beats EP, picked it up from Best Buy, and it was on sale. Now, the reason why I decided to get this pair of headphones is because of its battery-less um, attribute. As you know, most Beats headphones require AAA or AA batteries, but in this case, this is not powered by any battery. And so we are going to unbox the Beats headphones. Now, one, one of the reasons why I'm excited about it was because is because this one sells for $70 plus tax, so $77 here in, in, um, in California. And it's got great reviews on Amazon, on BestBuy.com, and on other audio sites. I mean, it is what it is. I'm not expecting it to act like a studio or a Beats solo, but I expect it to act like a Beats headphones. And... Um, one thing I'll use this for is to power my my red iPad, which I actually use with my with my 25 keys um, keyboard. A very nice wrap. The box itself looks expensive. Typical of um, the presentation of the product. There it is. Ooh. If you haven't noticed by now, I do love red. And um, this is it. There you go. The Beats EP. Change the way you hear sound. Right now, the only comparison I have is are these um, earbuds. So when you open the packet, you get this, this nice little tab that you, you lift up. And it reveals the Beats headphones in a nice little pouch. So let's, so let's open it. Opening the pouch for the first time to reveal the headphones. Now again, this is nice suede pouch, huh? This is less than a hundred bucks, $77 to be exact. It also comes with all the papers and manuals. But this, these are the headphones, Beats. They're, they're said to be noise canceling headphones and um, We'll see if they're good enough. Now, what I've noticed early on is that the cord is really flat. It's a flat cord. And unlike the studio or the solo, this one is really connected to the can. And <clears throat> if you're not careful, you actually run the risk of ruining it. There is a mic. If I'm listening to it on my iPhone and someone calls me, I could easily take the call without having to remove the headphones. I will now plug my Beats into my iPad to see if it really is worth it. I mean, how can you get how can you go wrong with $70 on a pair of Beats headphones? So Powering up my my Windows 95 iPad. Turning on Spotify. I am now going to take this out. Put on. Oh, nice. Again, no batteries. Now let's listen. The highs are good. I actually can't hear my voice while I'm while I'm talking. I'm listening to I'm listening to Zed's uh, "Beautiful Now." 
So I can hear the pianos. The drums are coming in. We're about to hit the drop. The bass is there. The attack on the bass is quite decent. But if I am to compare this with the studio and the solo, where you got the bass really going in, you can hear the sub. Here you're hearing more of the attack on the bass. The voice is clear. The new one says are good. So let's listen to another song. Now I can hear my voice. Um, how about me? So I'm playing Me, Myself, and I by g Easy. You got BB Rex on, on the hook. Her voice sounds good. So yeah, I mean, if these are 808s that I'm listening to, I can hear the 808s. Um, I just cranked up the volume. It's pretty good. I'm not irritated by, by the sound I'm hearing. Um, it's not obtrusive. I like, I like the fact that I actually couldn't hear my voice when the music's playing. Um, it's, it's amazing. For the purpose of having a nice, decent, aesthetic, um, practical sounding pair of headphones on the go, is in itself uh, a worthy investment as long as you take care of it it actually gets the job done so if you're out in the market looking for a pair of decent headphones and you want to know if this would stack up for the price of the unit i'd say yeah comes in blue black red um not sure if it also comes in white i guess but yep Good job, Beats, and um, keep it up. By the way, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Your subscription is highly appreciated. Again, this is Paco Alas Paco Chaga.